Okay, I'm going to be talking about Khan Academy, which is a massive open online course system um, comprised of various subjects, all available online for free. Um, it's a website. Uh, it's not a database that we need to pay for or sign up for. It's freely available. Um, the focus is going to be uh, making our patrons aware of Khan Academy so that they might be able to access it and learn on their own. And the focus of, um, ma of any massive open online course system, uh, including Khan Academy, is making uh, lessons in various subjects available uh, for uh, any user to use at a self-guided pace. Um, with Khan Academy, it covers a wide variety of subjects, including math, science, economics, arts, humanities, um, test prep, and in, it also includes some very interesting partner content, such as MIT K-12, Crash Course, and Exploratorium which are all um, specifically geared towards children. So um, we can also tap into helping kids learn more at their own pace. Um, what's great about these courses um, is that uh, users can pick up wherever they feel like they need to. Um, there's not necessarily a linear progression with anything. So if a user wanted to specifically brush up on algebra, they'd be able to start anywhere within algebra. They can also take a beginning assessment to see where it is they feel like they need to start. Um, signing up for Khan Academy is free. Everything on Khan Academy is free. Um, you can sign up with your Facebook, with Gmail, or with an individual email. Um, I went ahead and signed into mine. Once you sign up, um, you're taken to a dashboard, which is what this area is, and you can start on any program that you choose. You can look at your progress once you get started into the different subject areas. Um, you can work on your profile and um, the the system actually incentivizes progression in your skills as you gain more skills and get farther and farther into the different programs you earn badges you can unlock different avatars and customize that more see this is one that i haven't earned yet um, it generally tries to make the learning experience for all of these different subjects fun. Um, and beyond the basic um, subject areas and the partner content, there's also some pretty interesting resources specifically for high school students looking to get into college, as well as um, for educators, there's some sites that um, go specifically into um, new teaching theory. Here's an example of a history lecture, which is a simple seven-minute lecture. Uh, you finish it and you can report back on the quality. And once you go through all of the lectures, um, you can get to quizzes that will quiz you on the content of the lectures and assess how much you were able to learn from it. So with Khan Academy, what we'd be doing is um, adding links on our website to Khan Academy, um, simply explaining what it is, what users can expect to find there, and then also adding shortcuts to it on our desktop for both our devices and our public computers. And it's pretty simple. It doesn't cost the library anything to 
exploit this free resource, and I think it's really going to be helpful to our patrons.